been known for quite a while that um, plant-based diets are actually um, beneficial in kidney disease uh, in general, and that has to do um, primarily, I think, you know, both, both the, a couple of reasons for it. One is that um, plant-based um, diets are, <coughs> excuse me, are alkalinizing. Um, so the urine pH, you know, it, um, is, you know, if it's neutral, it's around seven. Um, in ketogenic diets that are meat-based, um, ten, uh, tends to go down quite a bit. You know, it can be like pH five, for example. Um, that has to do with the um, uh, the amino acid profile of animal proteins, you know, which is very rich in uh, cysteine and methionine that acidifies the urine, um, which is probably not much of a problem in, in people with healthy kidneys, um, but in people with um, you know polycystic kidney uh, kidneys or chronic kidney disease, um, that can become a problem because then um, they have a much more elevated risk um, for kidney stone formation. And there are these microcrystals that can form. Um, and that's um, <clears throat> some of the research in my lab um, where we also discovered that these microcrystals, uh, which eventually go on to form kidney stones, uh, that, uh, that they can accelerate uh, disease progression in polycystic kidney disease. Um, so you can antagonize this by keeping the urine alkaline which also raises the urine uh, citrate levels, and citrate is you know, one of these components um, that the kidney uses to uh, defend against um, uh, microcrystals and uh, kidney stones. Um, so there's a lot of clinical data out there um, suggesting that alkalinizing diets, so plant-focused diets, are um, beneficial in chronic kidney disease in general, um, and you know, that's what we have been using.